Today we're going to be making chicken braised with fennel. Fennel is a somewhat unfamiliar vegetable in the United States. I first learned to cook with it when I was living in France. And in fact, it's a recipe in my forthcoming cookbook, La Vie Rustique. Fennel has a slightly licorice flavor, so when you eat it raw, you taste the licorice, but when you braise it, cook it, as we're going to do today, it caramelizes and has a very sweet flavor. As you can see, the fennel is kind of an unusual shape. It has these long green fronds. So first of all, then we're going to trim them back, reserve the feathery fronds. We're going to use those later for garnish. Take each fennel bulb, trim the bottom end, and then cut it in thin slices lengthwise. You'll see that once they're sliced, they look like little hands. Then we're going to slice them again. Set the fennel aside. Next, take your lemons and cut them in half and remove the seeds. Then cut each half into three pieces and put them in a bowl. Sprinkle with salt. This helps to bring out some of the juice and the flavor. Now, add your chicken pieces, the fennel, the oregano, salt, pepper, and gently turn it just to marinate for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, we'll start to cook. Heat half of the olive oil in your saucepan, Dutch oven, whatever pan you're using. You will need a cover. When the olive oil is starting to kind of smoke, add your chicken. We're gonna brown it, you know, and if you need to work in two batches, that's fine. If you crowd the chicken too much, it will sort of stew rather than brown. Cook about four to five minutes on each side to get a nice browning on your chicken, and then remove it. Now add the rest of the olive oil and the fennel. The fennel is brown, then add the wine and the water and scrape up any bits that are clinging to the pan. These will help to thicken and be part of the delicious sauce. Return the chicken to the pan, cover, reduce the heat to low, and simmer for about 40 minutes. And you can always take a look and give a stir if you think it's getting too brown or reduce your heat. When it's ready, add the little bits of fennel, that fennel frond that we've chopped as a garnish. Add the lemon zest, and if you want, the black or green olives. Adds a little bit of extra color and flavor. You've got a wonderful main dish. All you need is perhaps a grain pilaf and a seasonal salad, and it's not only fit for family and friends, but for a special occasion.